Hey guys, it's AJ back again. Today I got a new video over Cardano Village. So let's get into it. So Cardano Village is a new metaverse that's on the Cardano or ADA network. It looks like currently right now it's more like an NFT metaverse because it's more like 2D than 3D, but currently they are upgrading to the 3D model and it is on mobile and PC. So in the Cardano Village, there's no same house. They're all different and some of them are like night, some of them are day, some of them are winter, some of them are summer. So each of the plots of land have their own unique to them. This project is based out of Korea. Currently as of right now in the village you can carry out different activities such as like land, houses, and house decorations. And they're continuing to keep on developing the land and getting more like utility to the land as well. The village map currently right now they're allowing you to place C NFTs on your Cardano village land. So you can actually see your NFT from the world map which I'll show you guys in just a minute. Currently as I said before they do have two different types of maps a 2D and a 3D. The 2D is more to display the NFTs on the map and you can kind of see your design from over the top 2D map. And the 3D map composed of polygons and quarter views. But you mostly see this in 3D games that's going to be coming out. And three guys they are just new, they are interactive, and they're always supportive on their Discord and through their Twitter as well, so make sure you check them out there. And then here's like an overall view of the map. Currently right now they just have the Charles Village, which is the northern side of it. And they're actually still progressing to build these next four. So we're still early on this. Here's the roadmap. Currently they are revealing the continental map of the Cardano Village. Also they are at the series one of the Cardano, uh, Cardano Village minting. So this is super early. They're just now revealing the actual continent for the first one. And they have, I think there was like five or six continents and then now they're actually minting them. So after that, you know, you can see they're gonna detail the map a little bit more, allow you to play houses and pictures wherever you want. The community voting which I'll get to as well and the series 2 which is going to be the second continent so that seems pretty interesting and currently as of now they were selling tickets for the plots of land all the collections did sell out and they do have one more sell coming up within the next day or so I'll have more details at the end of the video for you guys on that so you don't miss it and then currently right now this is actually the Cardano's 2D map. So as you can see over the top, this is the continent, the green, the gray is going to be the other continents uh, that soon come out. But currently it's the green continent right now. And if I zoom in, we can actually kind of zoom into people's land and see their NFTs or kind of see who even owns it. So for example, I can click on this one. And he's got this as the NFT. And the nickname he can put, I think as well, you can put like different websites. That one doesn't have one. Oh, sorry. Yes, it's the buttons right here. So the buttons like Twitter and Discord, you can put your own website there for now until the 3D comes out. There is actually a 3D map currently right now. You're actually at the top of their website and you come down to 3d map download you can download it for windows or mac which the mac is coming soon but you can at least download it for windows for now and you guys can check out the 3d map for the cardano village after that we also have the guide this will show you guys how to set up your account or your wallet how to get uh, money to your cardano village wallet i'll show you guys that just as a quick preview but if you hit guide there's no purchase limit per wallet you can buy one at a time and you can copy the amount and the address and then paste them in the uh, Yori or the D-List wallet. And if that doesn't work for you guys, if you guys actually come back up, instead of clicking the guide, come down the map guide. And this will actually come up and give you guys different options and help you walk you through each step that you need help with from there. So some of the frequently asked questions is how many is minted at the random stages. The first stage there was 3,000 units sold for 35 ADA. The second stage there was 3,000 units sold for 40 ADA. In the last step, step 3, there was 4,000 units sold at a price of 45 ADA. So it got more expensive as it went. The earlier people got it cheaper and then it got a little expensive as it went. 
And then also they're asking, is there any OG membership? There's no uh, OG membership on this one. So that's a quick little brief view over the Cardano Village. This is actually the Cardano light paper. So it's just going to go over the different kind of land and the NFTs. They are trying to keep this game like Roblox and Second Life. The components of the Cardano Village is the land, which is the continent. It's currently made up of all the villages and major events in Cardano. The continents can expand indefinitely, but however, they cannot go to the other continents. So they're kind of separate on that. The villages, the most important like element of the Cardano village. And the village is mostly just an NFT currently as of now. The groups, the DAO, the Decentralized Autonomous Organization groups, they're formed when more than a hundred villages of the identical theme come together so there's like the winter the summer the you know the night the day so if you get actually a hundred of the same ones together then you would actually create a group or a decentralized autonomous organization and at that right you guys have all have voting rights and you guys can give power to certain nfts and the nft should be issued at the main series are in the form of the houses and for the main NFTs, you guys got to have the NFTs to actually use the main features in Cardano Village, which is more like the voting rights, interior functions, inside and outside the house. So it gives you guys the ability to work on your land or your NFT is what they're describing. The land NFT is designed or designated land on the map. An NFT that owns land on the map, users who own the main NFT will have the right to own the NFT at a very low price. Membership. So this goes back to the grouping and getting you guys' group set up so you have the voting power. Uh, once you have that, you guys can, the group can actually use paid to earn function uh, in the future. So you guys can like uh, set up like play to earn stuff through your piece of land as the group. So guys, one more thing I do want to let you guys know. This is like the main important part. They actually have a one more public land sale for 6,375 plots of land. So as you guys can see here, this is going to happen on 2.15 at 1 UTC time. So you guys have a full day to get this going, but they're going to have a public sell for 6,375 plots of land. When it, times, when it comes time to purchase this, it's going to be on their homepage, which I'm going to have linked in the description for you guys. So make sure you guys are actually on the correct page, no scams. I'm going to have it linked. Um, but you guys want to make sure that you guys are there because you can purchase up to two pieces of land per transaction and then you can purchase up to five plots of land per wallet so if you're going to max out your wallet you'd be able to do five transactions so let me know what you guys think on this project if you guys have any plots of land or if you plan on getting a piece of land it seems like it is pretty early but with the metaverse, we all know how that is right now. It seems like it's the hottest thing. So if it is something where the devs can bring it out to a 3D game and you guys can actually sell NFTs, kind of walk around like the central land and sandbox, this will be one of the first of many metaverses on ADA or the Cardano networks. So let me know what you guys think of it in the comments and I'll see you guys on the next one.